wanna do be famous, just being real, yeah, just being honest. My haters won't always be nameless, give them no clout, I give them no power. I'd say in this day and age, now more than ever, we need each other, like as a community, as a whole, everybody. More and more in my personal life, I'm seeing a lot of my friends on antidepressants, uh, medication for their anxiety, things of that nature. And that like speaks volumes that, you know, mental health is very, very vital at this point. You know, very often I see posts about checking in on your strong friends because ultimately they're the ones that do need it the most at the end of the day. And there's even that awesome Earth Gang song, shout out to Earth Gang, uh, about checking in on your strong friends. And as I do state its importance of how we should be doing it, everybody should be practicing it, um, I'm wondering why a lot of y'all are posting it. Because a lot of y'all that are parading the phrase to check on your strong friends, you're not doing that, or you're thinking that you're the strong friend and you're not. The people, at least in my personal life that I've dealt with, that post things along those lines, it, your leeches, you fold under pressure, you're not that reliable, and the circumstances of your life aren't even that hard for you to be a strong friend. But I just know y'all be cramped up in your bed and you see that checking on your strong friends post and you're like, oh my God, he talking about me. Now that you're hearing this because you're not the strong friend, you're feeling attacked by what I'm saying. So you're probably questioning, who is the strong friend if it's not myself? I'll tell you, your strong friends are the ones that have been here for you even though they've had things going on behind the scenes. Your strong friends show their strength by their actions and they don't tell you how strong they are. And yes, that means they didn't repost that tweet that probably like Justin LeBoy fucking tweeted about being strong or whatever. Now, if you know that you're not the strong friend and you're willing to come to terms with that, all that's really left for you to do at this point is to just do that checking in on that you're trying to tell everybody else to do. Because like I said at the beginning of the video, we need each other as people in general. We're social beings. And in conclusion, to address the strong friends, don't wait on it at the end of the day. You probably haven't been because you know what to expect from people. Just know that even though your life is getting hard and the walls feel like they're caving in on you, just know that there's someone out there that probably feels the same sentiments that you do and you're not alone. So that's all I really have to say about it. Uh, it's somewhat of a serious topic, but I had to address more so the, the cappy people about it because you're really, you're not helping society. That's all I got for y'all. Like, comment, subscribe. Love you.